Did you know? Student participation in intramural sports reached a record high by 1947, but there were no facilities to accommodate the demand. Student leaders wrote letters to Oklahoma State University administrators hoping for a new space to play the sports they loved. Students held frustration for the lack of accommodations for intramural programs and were determined to have their voices heard. And in response, in April 1963, a 3,000 student petition was given to President Wilhelm. It would be two years before a referendum was passed for a new facility. Students took the helm and voted in favor of a fee each semester to help pay for a proportion of the construction costs. March 1966, the Board of Regents approved a $1.9 million facility to be constructed for students at OSU. It was estimated that the 127,000 square foot recreational building would be able to serve 25,000 students. The completed and furnished facility opened in 1969. The building was named the Colvin Physical Education Center in honor of Valerie Colvin's 40 years as a professor of physical education and leader of the intramural program. By 1974, the campus had grown and there was a need for expansion. New plans were drawn and featured, new lighted tennis courts, intramural playing field, and an annex for general activities. The addition also included four indoor basketball courts, four outdoor basketball courts, a jogging track, eight racquetball courts, and an outdoor exercise course. By 1976, over 20 flag football games were scheduled on the 13 fields nightly, and 16 sports clubs were formed. 3,000 students had played on Colrec intramural teams that year. Finally able to match the demand, campus intramural programs had reached a golden era. The Colvin Center continues to play a major role in making OSU America's healthiest campus.